Welcome back, you guys. This is the Syndra, continuing my Hoi for Japan campaign, where we are gonna go to war with China. So let's go. Marco Polo Bridge incident. This does not put me into war, but it it locks a decision in my here to escalate the war in China, which is gonna be interesting. We're gonna see what happens now. Am I ready for this war? Mm, probably not. Eh, definitely not. But we have our 24 strong divisions here. Let's see. Are you ready for this? You are actually not bad. Yeah, you're not bad at all. You are quite bad. And so are you. You're way too wide. I need to cut you down, preferably. Also, if I just uh, remove... Remove and add and add. Let's just keep it like this. And then I need to cut these two dudes. Uh, once I have 10 army experience. Let's go to speed 5. So, I should have air superiority here. Um, these are the close air support. Uh, I'm not making any of these, am I? No, but I have um, 12 of these in storage. But, yeah. Our naval dominance will be just complete. China does not have a strong navy. They have five, they have seven ships. God damn. Uh, let's see here. Uh, military Affairs Commission. That's, that's not bad. Chinese Unity. Surrender limit plus 15%. Really? Okay. Low inflation. Uh... So they do have some inflation, but it's not bad. Okay. I mean, I'm treating this like a EU4 country right now. Daily command power gain multiplier. Okay, so they are not making a lot of... Yeah, incompetent officers. Recruitable population factor. Oh. Army corruption. Oh, division attack, defense, and mobilization speed. So this will offset my penalty as well. Oh. Uh... Oh, that's not bad but here's the thing is I cannot secure China until I am at war with the United States so yeah and if I want to do that I would have to go to war with the, with uh, for the Philippines which is guaranteed by America as I recall yeah they're a puppet of America okay well, once I start this war, I'm probably going to go after the Philippines next. Okay, so we got the excavation done. Okay, this is going to cost me three civilian factories for 60 days. Yeah, we have enough of that. So let's just click this and get some more aluminum. This is... Yeah, this was in the islands to the south, wasn't it? Yeah, it highlights. Oh, I like that. So we're going to have some aluminum down here. Good, good, good. Uh, we have a lot of things done here. Let's go ahead and grab computing machine. Let's go have, ahead and grab both of these. If we are going to go to war, we're going to need to get our tech in order, shall we? Ah, that's good. Okay. It's only uh, Pepsi, so relax. I'm not boozing up during this. Uh, you go on the border here. Yeah, these guys are all united against me. Let's see. Chinese authorities claim that the breaking point has been reached in regards to our unwarranted aggressions towards China. Our demands for reparations have been refused, and there are reports of Japanese nationals coming under attack in Shanghai. If we needed an excuse to deal decisively with the Chinese, this is it. We get an annex war goal for both of these. We lose Imperial Sanctions. Hirohito loses this. Yeah, they're gone now. Marco Polo Bridge Incident. So, I can go to war with you right now. But uh, I cannot finish the... If I don't finish the war... Huh, do I want to start a war with the United States before I finish China? Well, my navy is really, really strong right now. 
Let's go ahead and do Strike South. And... Give me a second here. My apologies for that. That was my mom. So I kind of can't say no to my mom right now. But anyway, that was uh, unfortunate. And maybe I'll have to start learning how to cut things like that out of my videos in the future. But anyway, so let's go ahead and declare this war, shall we? So we can declare war on both of these dudes. So I have... I can escalate the war, it says. Escalate the war in China. The United States gain base war support by 2.4%. Modify... Modify Marco Polo Bridge incident by... Oh, so this slowly gets a, rid of it. That's good. So the negative thing I just got, the Marco Polo Bridge incident... It's been reduced. Okay, good. That's awesome. Okay, come on. Go away. I get it. You're pissed. But, um... Let's go ahead and try to take Beijing, shall we? Decisions available. War bonds, industrial lands... Hmm. Industrial land appropriation. Um, I lose war support and stability, and I gain a building slot in Tokai. What? No. War bonds. Consumer goods factories minus 5%. For 180 days, yes. Give me that. Consumer goods factories went down. Okay. So they're pushing into us to a degree. What is more of these? Yeah, industrial land appropriation. I don't really like the idea of dropping both my war support and my stability. So let's just tag this out. I don't want it. So my calf have broken through over here. That's good. And I'm going to go ahead and edit these guys right now, since I have the army experience for that. They should be better, even though they've dropped uh, in number, they are stronger. So, let's go ahead and take these and surround them. If we can get uh, Shaxi to capitulate quickly, that would be definitely in our favor. Or maybe if we can just uh, get a stack wipe on some of these guys. Uh, let's go ahead and support this. Come on. I kind of want to kill some of these dudes, preferably. So we're holding over here, but we're pushing into this and killing them. That's good. Um, I think I'll make uh, an entire fresh army. Let's just make 24 dudes right now in Kyushu. Okay. So, my cab, are you breaking through right now? You should be. It's two on one. And these dudes have what? They just have other dudes. They got nothing except dudes in there. Come on! Come on, you can do this! Uh, we were able to break through over here, and we got us around. It's one guy, but still. Let's just go ahead and wipe him out. Uh-huh. So, are we grabbing Beijing? Maybe. What is this? This is, uh... I can't see the city name. Tianjin. 
Okay. Well, if we can grab that, then we can squeeze on this, and then we can maybe wipe out everybody in here. Carry, carry. No, I'm not making those, so that's fine. Okay, we have a lot of army experience right now. So, I'm thinking I change you guys up to what I wanted you to be. Ow. Uh, I'm gonna need to stock up a bit more experience for that. Unfortunately. Uh, don't let him regroup here, guys. Kill that guy. Okay. Go ahead and push. Wonderful. Let's take a look at the casualties. Oh, this is new. Um, 5,000... 33,000. Damn! That is not bad. You should also keep going, if you don't mind. Oh, they're getting attrition over here. Let's escalate the war in China. Oh, I can keep escalating it to get rid of the... Uh, the penalty. That is good. So how much is it each time? Right now we have 30... And 15. And I'm guessing it's gonna keep going up. What is this? Communist infiltration? Anti communist sweep. We have no communists. We're fine. Uh, okay, so we took Beijing. Good, but we were not able to get a surround on those guys. Okay, so we need new orders for my tanks. No, these are not the tanks. Also, you're kinda... There we go. Uh-huh. There we go. Okay, so tanks. We need to start working towards the river. And then once we're there, we'll just go over the river and grab this. Go. And we have air superiority. And we're doing a little bit of strategic bombing. What did I set you to again? Forts and factories. Okay, good. That's what I prefer. Leave the infrastructure alone if you can. So my tanks are squeezing over here. That is good. I like having the calf here on the desert and the, the mountain, like this shitty province. It's very bad infrastructure over here. And we have plenty of army experience, I think, now to... It's a, you are just motorized and nothing else. You guys, I'm going to change over to... A mix of motorized and tanks. I'm gonna give you recon and I'm gonna save it costs 70 for this. Damn! Okay, do I have. I need more motorized for that. Hmm. Well, what if I just get rid of these guys? Now, if I swap all of you over for the tanks. It's going to cost us more motorized? How does it make any sense? How many motorized am I making right now? Ah, oh, barely any. Well, let's uh, queue that up for the uh, future, at least. Uh-huh. Let's put you above the fighters. Yeah, there we go. So we're slowly making our way through here. Let's have two of you attack in here. We're having some supply issues. Yeah, you guys took control of Beijing. Ask for control of state, Beijing. You refused? You're my puppet. What the what the fuck? 
So they do have a port here, but I think they got overrun there. And this invalidated my tank orders. Wonderful. Alright, go and do this again then. going 15% in our favor. I need it to be at 30. So I can escalate this even more. Yeah, the United States is gaining a lot of war support by doing this. But, um... Oh, well. It should be fine. I mean, who are the Americas, anyway? Did they do anything good in the, in the Second World War? I think not. They came late. Uh, favor the army, favor the navy. This does nothing. And this changes it back towards more stable. Well, I like it the way it is right now. We need the army to be stronger. So, we grabbed an airport over here, but you guys should be assigned to these guys. Yeah. Follow them around as much as you can. Strike South Doctrine is done. We can get an alliance with Siam. Is that going to help us? In this war, no. Is it even worth it? They have no army. Why would I want an alliance with you? We can get a non-aggression pact with the Soviets. That's fine. So we don't have to worry about them, at least for a while. Uh, the, there's nobody protecting the capital. Well, not the capital. The city over here. So, you guys, go ahead and attack into them and keep them busy. And he's across. Wonderful. We got the city. Stop attacking. It's fine. Wonderful. So, it seems the field marshal has all of this as his border, but he's dividing it up. The Cav have the stuff on this side of the river and the north. The infantry have this, but the tanks are a bit too big right now. Let's go ahead and cut them down to where the river is. And he automatically fills in with the infantry. That is an awesome new feature. Uh, can you push in behind him? Thank you. And he's gonna die. And you, my friend, are gonna go here. Thank you. And keep going. If we can cut this off, that would be awesome. Can we? There we go. So these uh, five divisions are going to die. They have no supply. Uh, I can actually bypass this, I think. The following will bypass the focus. Does not have the national spirit Marco Polo Brits incident. China has capitulated. So if I actually do this war just by conquering all of China. Ah, uh, so this is like if America attacks me, I can do this? I don't think we need radios. I was going to put you on hold. Um, I would like to unlock this. We're going to need some destroyers at some point here. We go tanks. Go ahead. So there was an order... Oh, you just push all orders. That's fine. I could give you last stand, force attack. Your armies will get an advantage of offensive bonus at the expense of some disadvantages. Cannot retreat while attacking. Strength damage taken. That's going to waste a lot of equipment, though. Yeah, we should maybe do that on the infantry, though. So if I do... Force attack, and force attack on you, but not on the tanks, because they don't have... I don't have the equipment for the tanks. And how long does this last? 
Seven days. Oh. Emergency factory conversion, women in the workforce, and anti-communist sweep. I don't think that's a problem. And then we have... Um, women in the workforce gives me recruitable population, but stability goes down. Okay. And Mac... Emergency factory conversion. So this swaps civilian factories for military ones? What? At the cost of war support and stability. Ha. Huh. Maybe for the future. I don't think we need it for this war, though. So, the plan is to... Have the tanks on this side of the river, if you don't mind. Grand Assault is done. So this is Motorized Mechanized Planning Organization Breakthrough. Max Planning. More Organization. Breakthrough. Organization. Supply Consumption. Yeah. Let's go down Assault. Yeah, I'm going to have some motor rest. Definitely. Hmm. Let's go ahead and get rid of this. Escalate the war in China. So, what's left? One more time and then we can get rid of it. Good. So, we're getting our attack bonus... It's going away. Our attack penalty, that is. And this looks horrible. Okay, keep going. And the tanks, you're gonna go down to Nanjing. So, what is your stability? Uh, you don't have national unity anymore. Oh, right, he has this uh, thing. Yeah, surrender limit, 15%. We're probably going to have to wipe out all of China. And that means we have to go all the way down to uh, Shenzhen. It's uh, Chongqing, right? The, the, the QI is usually Qi. Chongqing. I think. Um... Let's go ahead and split you guys up. Go ahead and attack into this. There's nobody in the city. You guys keep them busy. We are going to need a lot of motorized at some point. Okay, go ahead and just grab all of this. If you don't mind. There's a dude there. Hmm. Let's just secure this state over here. Shandong. Come on. Uh, can you go in here? It looks like this guy is moving there, but we might be able to... I was going to say take him out, but apparently not. So there is a naval base over here. Go ahead and push. Wonderful. Uh-huh. Push. Overrun! Nice. Oh, I forgot about my marines. I, I completely forgot about you. I'm so sorry. We might as well start planning for the Philippines then. Do we land in Manila? No, let's land here. And uh, you guys need to train as soon as you get there. You guys are not ready for this. Um, come on, guys. Wipe them out. Uh, we do have a lot of air experience, but uh, Navy experience is non-existent. guess we're not fighting any that are re relevant here. Army experience. Is there something I can do with this? I could add support artillery here. Yes. 
I was gonna add logistic company, but we don't have enough motorized for everybody. I'm gonna delete this one. Go away. You're fine. I can add a recon to you. I can add recon and an engineering company to you. I think. You guys just go over here. So we need light tanks and motorized. Weird. Usually I just need support equipment and rifles. Escalate the war in China. There you go. So it's gone, right? Yeah. Secure China has been bypassed. Okay. Good, good, good. So our penalties to that conflict are no longer there. And that is my new division. So I'm going to add you to this guy. You now have four out of five. Let's go ahead and check. Uh, three, three. Reckless. Uh, no. Sure. There we go. So let's see here. The plan is to move you guys a bit further here. There we go. And I probably need to fix these orders that you guys have. Yeah, there we go. Execute all of your orders. Oh, we got a convoy. Or they attacked our convoy. Non-aggression pact with the Soviets. Uh, it's still 1938. Let's go ahead and work our way towards the artillery here, at least. And let's unlock the field hospitals. Ichigo? Ichigo? Uh, what is this? Japan, the end of the war is in sight. With a final push and determined effort, we can bring the conflict to a swift conclusion. However, should we not be able to grasp victory within the next year, we may suffer internal instability as public opinion rises against the increased war effort. United States gain base war support. National Spirit Ichigo. Which grants attack bonus against country. Activates mission to conquer China. We're getting massive penalties. Uh, we're, we're buffing the Americans by doing this. Oh, the, not, the Soviets agree, agreed to this. Bypass the Philippines. Dutch East Indies and British Malaysia. Well, hmm. We're probably going to go to war with the Philippines anyway. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and grab this right now so we get some more people. Uh, yeah, and now we have some resistance to occupation. If I just tell you guys to... Uh, how much does this cost? 18. Come on, force attack. I don't have enough command power. Oh, this one is 58. Damn! Come on, guys. Just keep it up. I'm going to have to micro this a bit more, I guess. Yeah. Mm. We should start focusing on capitulating uh, some of these warlords, shall we? Let's go ahead and take two of these out at the same time. Force attack. Come on. Go. This is proving to be quite difficult to do. You have a lot of manpower in reserve. And we have a year to take out China. Otherwise, people are going to laugh at us. 
And we get some penalties, I imagine. Some inst some stability and war effort. Okay, mm what if I just put the tanks on aggressive? No, you don't have enough resources for that. Ah, uh, this is annoying. We're almost done with this. What if I... Uh... Nah, we don't have to do this. Do we? Nah, 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 it's fine. What is the uh, the China one? Demand Indochina. Uh, Ile de France, not controlled by France. Okay. Mm okay. Conquer China. I have 336 days left. Okay. Let's just get rid of this. Mm -hmm. This is going to take a while, I see. And they're on volunteer only. Shit. Come on, keep going. It's fine. Come on, take them out. You know what I gotta do? I gotta go navally invade something more important than this. I've been messing up with these dudes. Apparently they're a lot stronger now, aren't they? Special forces. The fact that they're limited means they probably should be a bit stronger, right? What if I land over here? Just go when ready. 28 days. Who's mm, having issues with support equipment? Yeah. Mm. I'm not sure if we can take out all of China in this uh, this time. We would have to actually break them and get a lot of pockets. Uh, can you push here? Okay. Come on, kick them out. All of them. There we go. Are we ready for this, guys? Come on. Go. Go. Keep pushing. I'm going to use my tanks to try to get to Nanjing, and I'm hoping, hoping that the infantry can just hold them there. War bonds. Oh, consumer goods factories. Yes, go ahead. So if I can grab this, if I can grab Nanjing, they're going to flee to here in uh, Shanjing. No. Chongqing. Come on. Uh-huh. Let's keep pushing while they are weak. Uh-huh. So you go down here. Uh, good, good, good. I'm gonna be careful that they don't pocket me here. Mm. I think I'll pull you guys back. Yeah. These guys were trying to push into me. Uh, okay. Keep it up. Keep it up. Let's try to extend them a bit. And go. They seem to be able to hold quite well. Even though all the penalties are gone. Or most of them are, at least. What is this? We have a lot of carrier stuff. Yeah, I'm gonna stop the uh, production of this. 
Are we only making... There's only one factory on this. Huh. We don't have that many factories on them. But we should be getting a lot of factories coming now. Yeah. Okay. And if I do manage occupied territories and we do gentlest, we should have less trouble with the damage here we're doing. I hope. Uh huh. We're almost to here in Shangxi. If we could grab Shangxi, that would be brilliant. And but this border has not moved at all. This is very slow, but we are making some progress. The fourth international. Come on, kick them out. So we take a look at the casualties. 190,000 and collectively it's 220 to 540,000 dudes dead. Uh, there's the spiritual mobilization. Um, let's go ahead and grab this for now. While we wait. Munich Agreement. Um, let's go ahead and shrink down my tanks to, like, this. Have the infantry take over. Because I need to push with my tanks here. And there's a 10 stack over here. But there's a river, so... If we manage to take this... We can maybe just have the entire tanks... On this side of the river. And just push. Support. As much as you can. Get them out of there, please. I want to change your orders. Just, uh... No, 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 no. Just keep pushing west. As much as you can. Boost to planning speed. This costs 92... Command power if I do it on him. So does everybody get it then? I think so. But that's the only one that was available there. Okay, so we've taken this. I'm gonna go ahead and shrink the tanks to the river here. And tell you guys to stop so you can move. Yeah. And then we can shrink uh, you guys to this side of the river. And yeah. There we go. Much better. Okay, so my marines actually got here. Go. Ah. Expand into every single direction, if you don't mind. Okay. You go here and here. No, here and here and then go out. You go to this city. And you move towards the capital. Attack this guy. Okay. So we're about to take Nanjing, it would seem. Uh-huh. So we've taken all of this. I'm going to do a fallback line like, hmm, let's just do a fallback line, ah, I don't know. If it's just one tile, it's going to get crushed. Okay. Go over here and crush him. Go ahead and fall back. 
We do have Shanghai, so we've not been cut off from supply, but we are kind of close. Um, you are actually out of supply. Shit. But the fact that they have to go ahead and deal with this means that the pressure is off on the other sites. On the other staging grounds. Go ahead and fall back. Ah, fuck. I think my marines are dead. But my tanks are almost to Shanghai or Nanjing. Go ahead and grab this for me. Oh, we've been cut off. Our tanks have been cut off. Guys, what the fuck are you doing? Let's still go ahead and do force attack. Push. And go ahead and help them. Okay. They were able to close the pocket on us. That's not good. Keep them busy while my infantry go ahead and takes this back. So we can get the supplies back here. Come on. Grab this, would you? Do I need to send an aggressive attack again? Now oh, there we go. Okay, so we got supplies back. Good, good, good. Okay, we are making progress. And there goes my marines. I guess I'll just train them again. How many can I train now? Ooh, I can have quite a lot of them. Let's make ten of them then. That's how many I can invade with. So because I have a lot of battalions, I can have more special forces. That is good. Don't push them. Don't let them push us back. Where are the tanks going? What? What the fuck? Why are my tanks now here in the middle? No, you field marshal idiot. You moved my tanks. Uh This is weird. Why did you move my tanks? What's left of the year here? 240 days. Well, we are making good progress, but we're not in Nanjing yet. And I could use a police force to crush down some of this stuff here. That's getting damaged. Or I could just give control of it to... If I give you control of, let's say, if I give you control of Hebe, uh -huh, then I don't have to repair it. Like, why can't I do it again? Give control of the state of Qingdao? Yeah. I'll just give you control of all the states. That way I don't have to repair it. Oh, what is this? This guy is sick. In his service to Japan, it seems General Otozo Yamata has pushed himself too far. As a result of the bad climate in their operational area, the general has now fallen ill and will likely need some time to recover. Until he gets well, he will not be performing at his usual level. Sick. Cannot use combat abilities. Leader skill bonuses. Oh, he's a cavalry leader now. 
Ooh, can I give you... Excuse me. Cavalry attack and defense. Let's go ahead and check all of my dudes here. You can't do anything that I need you to. You got nothing, and you got nothing. Okay. Should I swap you out for somebody more aggressive? Organization lost when moving. He's got more defense than you, but the planning speed is uh, not the same. But it's fine, I hope. So how is the deficit going here? We still lack a lot of motorized, and the support equipment is piling up here. This is not good. Oh, we don't need this anymore since we have our own supply of this. That's good. We need some more rubber. Really? I can't just cut down on something? Carrier naval... Uh... Hmm. Let's just cut down on the fighters. Instead of importing more, um, hmm. what's this? Thank you. More of these useless battalions. I'll grab some more steel. We're going to need a lot more steel. Mm -hmm. This is a very slow war. War of resistance. Coal liquefaction. Does this mean we can stop our trade somewhere? No. Okay. Warrior spirit allows kamikaze strike missions. No. Uh, I'm not going to touch the Philippines until we're done with our current war. So... We could go naval or we could go down here to get this bonus. I think we should go for that. It's a huge increase in attack and uh, defense and what else? And recovery rates. Yeah. I should have gotten that maybe earlier. Hmm, maybe. Yeah, definitely. I definitely should have gotten that earlier. Hmm. Well, this uh, border conflict is taking forever right now. I find it amazing that they are so resistant to us. You've got, like, no dudes. Neither do you. You've got some. And Shanxi has the most. Hmm. Okay, we actually have some political power we can spend on dudes instead of on decisions. Let's see, what can I get here? Division Attrition. Infantry Division Attack and Defense. Wow. Yeah. Let's go ahead and get that. 15% and 10%. And it's 1938. Let's go ahead and grab the encryption. And keep going. Uh-huh. How are my Marines coming along? Support equipment. Okay. Well, what if I just push you out? No, you're not even trained yet. Hmm. So, your capital moved to Ordo. So, we were able to grab uh, Shang-Chi's capital here. But my horsemen are not pushing at all here. Is my dude still sick? Yeah. Cavalry expert. Yeah. I like that. Oh, we're pushing. This guy here is dead. You're out of supply, man. There is no supply here for you. Okay, let's try this. Attack from two directions. Come on! Do I have to micro every single combat here? I don't want to. But I will if I have to. 
Okay, there we go. And now they attack back, but you're attacking across the river, and you are not succeeding. There goes the destroyer that I would like to make at some point. We're capped out on army experience. Really? I got nothing else I want to build here. We can unlock anti-air. But, yeah, maybe if I beef up the light tank. Like, just max it out right now. It's going to spend all of our experience. Most of it, at least. Uh, max speed drops quite a bit. So... They changed this. Uh, no, engine doesn't affect... The, okay, so the engine does not affect the reliability. Good. Okay, that's fine. And then we have air experience. So if I go ahead and I change your reliability and range. And then I turn on convert from stockpile. Oh, there's no stockpile. All oh, right, we have a deficit. <laughs> we have no stockpile. Shang Shi has capitulated. And we got some stuff from them. Good, good, good. So the next part is the communist China. One of the warlords has capitulated. We got five more warlords and then China itself. Does communist China count as a warlord? I'm not sure, but how many divisions do you have left? You have none. Okay, so that was like 15, 16 divisions that got wiped out from that. But uh, I'm going to have to stop here, you guys. So, our war with China is, you know, crawling along. We got 190 days to finish this. I'm not sure if we're going to make it, but hopefully we will. But it's okay. So, I will see you guys in the next episode. But until then, see ya.